So I used my dad's phone to um record my new update, but it's not letting me send it to YouTube because apparently my dad's phone doesn't like me. So I am going to use my phone to record the video that I was recording. And to be a video uh, craft update, and it is the first ever Deco Den iPhone case that I've ever made. And this is my phone. I'm using my dad's phone right now to um, take this video. And so this is the front of it. And it has like a light blue and white donut because it's Alice in Wonderland themed. And so it has like blue rhinestones and little blue beads. Um, the white silicone that's still squishy. And I made sure not to block my camera or anything. And then here's a Cheshire Cat inspired donut. And I didn't do these sides because they were just so skinny. I was like, that's too much effort. <laughs> but um, I really like how it turned out. And like here's a Cheshire Cat inspired lollipop. And here is a red rose. Like, it was a white rose, but um, it's one of the ones that, like, Alice was supposed to paint, and it never got done. And here's the side. And it's just, like, blue glitter stickers. And this is all... I've been using my phone... Sorry. <laughs> I've been using my phone now for about two weeks, like, while it's been like this, and nothing's gotten loose or anything. It's gotten a little bit dirty because of my jacket, but that's about it. And it's got some light blue rhinestones. And then some dark blue rhinestones up here. Some pearls. And here's the other side. And, like, I can take the case off and everything, which I'm really glad about, because I would never do this to my normal phone. And, like, you can see that I didn't um, cover the camera. So there's a butterfly, like literally butterfly, like in the movie, a little bottle with the drink me, um, little bubble things, pearls, a red card, soldier, a little Alice macaroon, uh, the little Alice in Wonderland, chibi, <laughs> um, the rose, the Mad Hatter's hat, Another Cheshire Cat lollipop, a little swirl, um, the rabbit's clock, and a black uh, spades soldier thing. <laughs> but the silicone is still squishy, and like, sorry, I know you guys can't really see that, but like, it's still squishy, and nothing's coming loose or anything. Like, I really like it. And just to make sure you guys can see this, sorry, uh, that was actually a picture, and that's my friend. The other one was a picture of um, a book that I was reading, and my teacher wanted to see the picture, so I, in order to remember, I had to put it as the thing. But um, as you can see, like, the camera isn't blocked at all. Yay, taping a vic video of a video, woo -hoo. Wow, this is just got really dark. Okay, anyway. So, there's that. And just so you guys can see it again. Um, I also made... I haven't glazed the front of these resin things yet. I've only glazed the back of them. And these are the first resin charms I've ever made, so they're, like, really simple because I didn't want to mess them up. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm getting kind of sick, guys. But, um, this is like a cherry sticker one. And I like this one. I just painted the back because I didn't have any glitter at the moment. <laughs> um, then I have this tiny, just like little bone sticker one. And it's pink on the back. It's like a hot pink. Um, I've got this butterfly one, like the one on my phone case, but it's in a 
little mold. And lastly, um, this is my favorite one actually right now because it's hot pink on the back and it is a puppy sticker and I think it just turned out really cute. Like I really like how it turned out and I'm really proud of myself for being able to do it because I thought I wasn't going to be able to. And I sanded down like all the edges and stuff so they're really smooth and just round it off. So yeah, um, that is the stuff that I made so far. And I actually just finished taking some new charms out of the oven. So hopefully I will be able to make another update soon. Thank you for watching guys. Um, rate, comment, subscribe. You know what to do. Bye.